Happy Friday, YouTube. Just hanging out at the house. Just got home from a short day at work. Listening to the new Rat-A-Tat, being a hipster, I guess. Stagger Lee, JYD. I found this in my closet, of just obscure, in a box of obscure stuff I have. Not too often you find them with the chain still. JYD, but like, yeah, if you saw my, uh, got a lot of cool positive feedback from my video yesterday with Adam West return on the blank comic book covers today um i kind of gave a prelude that i was expecting something big in the mail today and what i wasn't expecting was actually three ttms in the mail today so i figured i'd bust everything on cam and we could just all see what's in this stuff together right here minneapolis minnesota i can't remember who i sent it might be a timberwolf maybe or there's no telling Teddy Bridgewater. Wow, that's a good return. Dude, those are old. I sent those out a long time ago. Two rookie cards. Boom. That's sweet. Teddy Bridgewater. Dude, I probably sent those out like... How long ago did 2014 Prestige come out? Probably at least over a year. But yeah, very nice. Here's what the signature looks like on that one. Teddy Bridgewater. Then on that one, boom. That's a sweet score right there. I wasn't expecting that. Boom. So, starting it off hot with the Teddy Bridgewater rookie card auto. This next one is a great big box, and I have a pretty good idea of what's in this. This is actually a record box. But there was something else that I thought would fit in there perfect that I wanted to try to see if I could pull off a TTM with. Like I said, I've been sending out all kinds of obscure things other than just cards to get signed. So we open it up. Oh, ho, ho. yeah, buddy. Looks like there's a note or something inside of here. Oh, oh wow! Huge score. So let's let's just—I uh, probably already showed that, but yeah, I got an awesome TTM response. Oh, they're stuck a little bit. It's not too bad. Okay, I got a huge TTM return. Sorry for the pause there, guys, but since you know the size of the box, you probably knows what's coming, but. Anthony Pettis on one, two, let's see if we can get that to show up, there we go, two, the 2012 finest, that's the one, that one stuck to the back of this card, you see it stuck. We got him on another one. Very cool. This has been out there for probably over a month or two, but yeah, given that you've seen the size of the box, you can probably guess what's coming up next. No, it's not a pitcher, but it's the signed Wheaties box. So I guess he will sign. Yeah, that's a pretty sweet looking. Pull this back some so you can get the whole scale of it. But yeah, that turned out pretty sick, and. It, Anthony Showtime Pettis got the full signature and everything. So yeah, awesome, awesome. Wow. Another sweet Pettis item to add to the collection. He's such an awesome signer. You usually have to wait a little bit, but man, he hooked it up huge. That's five autos on one pack. Man, shout out to him. And you know he's got a long career ahead of him, and he'll be back into title contention before you know it. And then the last one... I can't even find. I got packages all over the damn place. The last one is another package that's similar to what you saw yesterday. The big white manila folder. And this got wet. Somehow, when I picked it up, it got wet. I don't know if there was water in my mailbox or what. 
Well, let's open this up and see what we got here. So let's see. Open it up here and see what we got. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, um, I also, a lot of people don't know, but I also collect gig posters. I gotta get these all set up for the camera here. But I also collect gig posters, and I saw, I was looking at comic books in the comic book store the other day, and I saw that Frank Kozik had had some exclusive, he had some exclusive uh, comic books come out. I think it was maybe last year is when these came out. But I knew he was a really cool guy, and I just dropped him an email, and I picked up two of each of these. There was almost a near set, but I asked him if he would be willing to sign these comic books if I set him a set to keep. And he uh, shot me his address, and sure enough, he was very cool to go ahead and hook it up fat on just not this one. This is right here is his auto, Kha'Zix 215. We got the Rocket Raccoon signed. Venom. Kha'Zix. And Deadpool. This, this was my favorite of the ones, but he hooked it up huge because he had signed three of them. And just to round it out, Wolverine, Kha'Zix Sign, 2015. Very cool of Frank Kha'Zix to, to take the time to do that. He was, wow, let's see, he hooked it up fat on that as well. Wow, what a freaking awesome mail day. It's days like today is the reason why you send out this TTM stuff. Totally happy with all this stuff. Tomorrow I'm actually going to a card show here in Oklahoma City. Uh, BGS is going to be there, and they're going to be accepting submissions for slab cards. Um, a different promoter's hosting it this time, so I don't know if it's going to be the same people as usual or what's going on with it. So it'll be interesting to see how that turns out, and hopefully I'll have some more stuff to show you because, as always, always expecting stuff in the mail. So hopefully I'll have some more stuff soon to show you guys. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Take it easy and enjoy your weekend. Peace.